This year, class 4-3-F has had fun doing a lot of Minecraft-related learning. We have used Minecraft to learn in social studies, math, language, art, and even having fun during DPA and gym. We would like to introduce you to some of the things we have enjoyed and learned from. During reading, we explored fiction and nonfiction by comparing two Minecraft books, The Minecraft Handbook and Descent into Overworld. The Minecraft Handbook has nonfiction features like a table of contents, titles, and subtitles, labeled diagrams and charts and text boxes. Descent into Overworld has features of fiction with characters like Jaina, Hamid, and Anne. It tells the story of three friends who are pulled into Minecraft to save the world from being taken over by the villain Hero Brian. The story is set in the real world, the overworld, and the nether and the end. At the conclusion of the three books, the three heroes solve problem and save the world. We read the first two Battle of the Blocks books earlier in the year and then had to wait until May for the release of an early version of book three in electronic form. The books are written by Canadian author Liam O'Donnell. He has published over 35 books for kids. He also teaches kindergarten and plays Minecraft. We made up questions to ask him and then had the opportunity to talk to him live on Skype. We asked him lots of questions like, What do you do when you are stuck looking for ideas when you are writing? What is your favorite thing to do in Minecraft? Can you make another Battle of the Block series called Blocks Are Now Coming Back with lots of cliffhangers? Could you make another seven books in this series so that there are ten? We wrote letters to Mr. O'Donnell to give him our feedback on the third book, which he will be editing in July and then publishing this fall. It felt very special to be invited to be beta readers for a book that hasn't even been published yet. Last year, Class 3F had a chance to be beta readers for the second book in the series, and they suggested that Mr. O'Donnell put Gumby Blockhead in book three. Everyone was excited when we ran into Gumby in chapter 17, especially Mr. Mr. Fogart. While we were studying math this year, we explored coordinates, isometric drawings, and logical thinking by doing pixel art, Minecraft 3D figures, and programming for the International Computer Science Day Hour of Code. We colored cartoon figures on grid, grid paper, and then we used X and Y coordinates to transfer the design into Minecraft by placing the correct color of block at the correct address. Dylan created SpongeBob. Josh did Patrick Starr. Austin did Trap Stilton. Here are some other examples that our classmates did. Because everything in Minecraft is based on blocks, we were able to practice drawing cubes and other 3D shapes with parallel lines by drawing a variety of Minecraft mobs. Here are some of our drawings. Can you recognize them? In Hour of Code, we used commands like left five, right eight, up three, down two to see a sheep. We have also enjoyed Minecraft during DPA and gym class. In the gym, we changed up a familiar game called Get the Bean Bag. In the game, each person is either a zombie, creeper, skeleton, spider, or ghast. When a creature is called, we race around the circle and then crawl between our teammates' legs to try to be one of the teams which gets a beanbag. Whoever gets the most beanbags is the winner. In the classroom, we often enjoyed a game of Silent Seatball using our foam block of Minecraft TNT. Our goal is to reach 100 tosses without any explosions. Creeper!
This year in social studies, we used Minecraft to show our learning by building a pioneer village, pyramids, and a Viking settlement. All of the grade threes worked together as they traveled on a sailing ship to the New World. After arriving, they had to chop down trees to build cabins and fences and then plant gardens for food. Everyone worked together and built a community church. The grade fours worked to build an Egypt settlement beside the river in the desert. Thank you for listening to our, our ventures in Minecraft. We have had a lot of fun learning with Minecraft and have learned a lot. We hope you have a great summer holiday.